What is going on guys, Junji here today for you guys is another GTA 5 video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys a new money glitch after the patch 1.20. Uh, super easy to do, it's kind of like a method slash glitch but it's very helpful and can help you guys out a lot in the new update to get you guys some new cars and weapons and before I start this video, yes I'm back on GTA kind of and what I mean by that I'll be posting GTA videos probably once or twice, maybe even three times a week, um, depending on how Call of Duty glitches and stuff like that is going, but, um, pretty much with that said, guys, let's start this video up for my video coming back into GTA. So, what you guys want to do is go to, the, go to the online session, onto Jobs, go to Rockstar Created, Missions, and then go to Blow Up 2. Pretty sure it's by Simeon. I'm not 100% sure on that, but, um... Once you have that set up, uh, get all your ammo ready and put it on hard as you guys will easily get. I mean, you can put on whatever you want, but by putting on hard, you guys will get more RP and cash. So I would advise doing this and pretty much just start up the match from there. Then once you guys have loaded up the match, all you guys really want to do is just kind of keep yourself occupied for a little bit. So if you guys have... As you guys see, you guys were allowed one friend into the game, so if you guys want, invite a friend to a game and just kind of get the cops on you, or just kind of mess around for, uh, until, I don't know, until you guys really get bored, uh, pretty much, just for a minute or two, or if you guys are just by yourself, like I am in this video, you guys just want to kill cops, more cops, more cops, um, until maybe you kill yourself or something, you guys want to try not to die, um, just, just cause, uh, try not to die, but, um, once you guys are done killing your cops and all that good stuff and you guys are ready to actually continue on to the mission as all this mission does, it's just kind of you guys have to use up the time. So maybe 5 to 10 minutes, that's all you have to do. Just kind of screw around, keep yourselves occupied so you're not bored. Once you're ready to actually continue on to the mission, you think it's a fair amount of time. Uh, you guys actually want to do it. So you guys want to get into the Banshee, um, blow up all the other cars. I would advise doing it in a sticky bomb in a very fashionable way as you guys will see here I do it here in a second um, and bang bang um, after that after you guys blow up the cars if you guys don't get cops good for you lucky lucky but if you guys do get cops like I do uh, obviously just call up Lester and he'll help you out there because he's your creepy uncle um, and then from there on guys you guys want to just go to the garage Put the car there, and you guys will get a fair amount of cash. I think you get around 18k and around three or a couple thousand RP, good amount of RP. And I do level up, so that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe for more daily Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and GTA 5 content, including glitches. And thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.